My name is Katie Gimbar, and I'm answering questions about my flipped classroom. This question comes from Karen in Florida. What about students with no access? Well, last year, my students were required to watch the video lectures for homework outside of class so they could be prepared for the topic we were covering the next day in class. The interesting piece of this is there's not a video every night. That's also important to understand. There's typically two to three within a week, so there was a range of time that students had to watch most of the videos within that week. So I made accommodations for the students with no access by allowing them to come in during lunch, during homeroom. There were often times if the student didn't get the required video done for that day, they could do that at the start of class because these videos are shorter, 10 minutes without interruption, and I could put them on a computer at the back with headphones before class actually got started and going. There's also other options of if they have computer access or um, you know, some kind of gaming system where they could watch the videos but without internet access, you could save them to a jump drive or onto a DVD where students could still watch them at any time at home. This year, it's been very interesting. I've been able to get a hold of a classroom set of laptops that have been re-imaged and the only thing that are on these laptops are my lecture videos. So now my students are actually interacting with the material in class in a controlled environment and I've learned so much from watching them interact with those videos in class. They watch them at different speeds, they interact with them differently in how they like to take the notes and go through the information. So it's a controlled environment where they watch the videos throughout class at their own pace within that week and that really eliminates a lot of the problems with the access issues. But they still have those videos online to go back to at any time when they need to review material or if their parents are helping them at home and they can interact with that material together. For more questions about flipping the classroom, visit the Friday Institute's website.